Looking ahead. So while putting together the uh, basically the skeleton bones of this episode last night, um, I was kind of not sure what to put, but actually found something. Um, Apple. Uh, reportedly having a secret satellite project. So this has been reported by Bloomberg. Um, and they are essentially investing in technology to beam data to devices. Now, it's fairly broad. Uh, we don't really know too much more at this stage. Um, but a couple of theories coming out. So potentially this is to boost internet coverage, um, trying to make Apple maybe a bit more independent of those third-party data providers, um, or to potentially create a network uh, that essentially just connects Apple devices to each other um so yeah essentially uh, all apple devices would be able to communicate without having to uh, pay an extra subscription well certainly that's what it seems like um what are your th- thoughts of this barry i think it's fascinating i think it's another example if if these if these rumors are true that apple is looking again to try and control their own ecosystem and imagine if they could remove the actual mobile providers out of their ecosystem and make it entirely apple it gives you yet another reason to stay within their stay within their gambit um, and so if it, if it is true it's fascinating um, i i don't know the technicalities around satellites i don't know what's possible and what's not what i do know is that satellite technology itself and kind of the network of satellites that is orbiting earth is really a really interesting resource that i think is undervalued if you look at how much of our world relies on satellite technology and it relies on the data and the information that gets beamed across the world, um, those satellites are incredibly important. And so the war for resources and the war for data and the war for all of this information actually comes from those satellites. Um, and so if, it, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't surprise me at all if Apple are looking at that very, very seriously as how to use that to their best advantage and how to ensure that the Apple ecosystem remains as clean and as insular as possible because that's how they yep. get you to buy their laptops and their phones and their services, etc. Um, so yeah, I, I'm fascinated by this. We'll have to wait and see what happens. What do you think, Chad? Definitely. I mean, I think it is an interesting one. So there's a couple of other uh, sort of noteworthy companies who are looking into this at the moment. Um, an example being SpaceX. Um, and the other interesting thing is we've seen uh, in the past some failed attempts at uh, launching satellites. Um, so I think, yeah, it's definitely going to be interesting to watch. And yeah, basically, uh, Tim Cook has apparently also given his stamp of approval and he's quite uh, keen on on pursuing this further. Obviously, these are just reports, so we'll have to see what happens. Um, but certainly, you know, when somebody so senior has buy-in to a project like this, um, I, I think it's definitely something to look at quite seriously. Pond, pond, pond across the pond.